Hey guys, Tech Tutorials here back with another video. Today I'm going to show you how to get iCloud for Windows. Uh, I was going to say Windows 7 since that's the operating system I'm using. But this will probably work on Windows Vista and 7. I'm not sure XP, but it could probably work. There's a chance. But the thing is that this iCloud is going out from Apple to these Windows operating systems. So basically, Apple has created this specialized on Windows. And as you see, Apple only creates applications, not programs. But they've created actually created a program that it's an EXE file, and it will actually download iCloud for you on your Windows OS system. Um, so, anyways, I'm gonna head over to Safari, and I'm just gonna paste the link in the one I've copied this before. It's uploaded to my media fire. Alright, now I haven't downloaded this at all too, so this will be my first probably step or whatever you could call it. And I will go through the whole process with you guys. I'm going to run it. I don't want to save it, I'll just run it. Come back to you guys when this is almost done. Alright guys, it's almost done. Time to get back to the process. And as you can see, there's 6, 5 seconds remaining. Uh, let that be finished and it's done let it verify all right it's done so as I see I click run click run again go through that that loading crap all right welcome to the iCloud control panel installer iCloud control panel will be installed on your PC PC that's the main keyword there I accept install let that install come back to you once that's done get ready for the countdown 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 0 all right I guess it's done for some reason it says iCloud control panel so you could access it in the Windows control panel. Alright, this is some epic shit. Click finish. Now I know you guys could probably get uh, you guys could probably get iCloud and you guys didn't want this video but I know I've been searching up YouTube for so much videos and so many that I just couldn't find any and I actually went through some research and I actually found iCloud for Windows and I actually got it somehow. So I'm just going to sign into my Apple ID being so right once your iCloud process is done <clears throat> uh, as you can see my iCloud storage is 5 gigabytes of 5 gigabytes available which means I already have the thing and it also shows the iCloud in my system tree over here and I could do all these things based on uh, based on my uh, iPod Touch, so all I have to do is connect it and I can upload the folder or get folder or get the bookmarks and I can also get contacts, mail and calendars but now I have to download Microsoft Outlook I don't want that shit, I'll just get that later on anyways this is the way to get iCloud on any Windows operating system thanks for watching this video, I'm sorry if I'm a bit boring today I'm, I'm a bit tired um, that's it, bye bye